so we know that the syllabus is reduced for neat examination neat ug okay so we know that the syllabus is reduced for neat examination neat ug okay so we are going to discuss that part of syllabus that has been reduced and what is the new syllabus something is added or not or only reduced reduced so we are going to see that regarding chemistry so first of all i am going to see that that syllabus which is reduced okay so listen actually total eight chapters has been reduced four chapters from 11th portion and four chapter from 12th portion of chemistry listen so what are these chapters you can see clearly states of matter hydrogen s block and environmental chemistry these are the four chapters from 11th class that has been reduced okay completely completely okay four chapter from the 12th part solid state complete surface chemistry complete polymers complete chemistry in everyday life so total eight chapters has been removed completely four in 11th and four in 12th so now what is the left syllabus that is for neat ug examination neat ug examination listen my dear students it is regarding chemistry right so here basic concept uh, where we will deal with the number of moles atoms molecules right law of conservation of mass etc atomic structure or structure of atom of bowl rule poly, poly rule exclusion right all the chapter all the topics are involved in this chapter now chemical bonding right dvt mot thermodynamics laws of thermodynamics right and solutions different levels of concentration one half factor these type of things all are included equilibrium which is having chemical equilibrium and ionic equilibrium both of the portions are in your syllabus then redox the electrochemistry and chemical kinetics all these chapters are there redox oxidation number balancing the equation electrochemistry cell galvanic cell voltaic cell balancing the equations right faraday's laws right chemical kinetics first order second order reactions arrhenius equation etc all are there and then periodic table nomenclature of elements which are having more than 100 atomic number and properties of spdf block elements and different type of physical properties atomic num uh, atomic size electronegativity electron gain enthalpy right these all are still in your syllabus p block my dear student listen p block a lot of number of topics has been removed from p block what is like that actually previously in your syllabus of neat examination neat ug so what was defined there by name like h2so4 like hno3 by name it was mentioned that means the compounds of the elements of p block that were in your syllabus but right now if you will check your syllabus you will find that only basic introduction of p block elements of all the all the groups in p block only the basic introduction that mean their electronic configuration their normal trends that are left in your syllabus that mean the compound of the elements of p block has been removed according to the syllabus but i will suggest that you will deal with the all uh, all content that will be lying in the p block because we cannot take risk yes the compounds of the elements of p block are not in your syllabus but for the safe zone we should cover the whole p block right i know that it is very vast but not very uh, deeply you should see all the topics that are in your p block right at least once okay then d and f block yes kmno4 and k2cr207 will be in your syllabus right then coordination vvd cft purification crystallization etc right fractional crystallization goc inductive that mean inductive hyperconjugation resonance these type of effect, electromagnetic effect that mean electronic displacement effect and then iupac nomenclature hydrocarbons alkene alkene alkyne aromatic hydrocarbon all are there alkene alkene alkyne and aromatic hydrocarbon all are there halo alkene right and halo arene that mean halogen atom directly attached to alkyl or directly attached to phenyl group or aryl group 
that is in your syllabus alcohol phenol ether that is in your syllabus reactions of phenol and reactions of ethyl ethers that are also in your syllabus then aldehyde ketone acid rcho rcor rcoh amines rns2 disonium salt 665 n2 plus cl minus right so n2 plus cl minus it is the disonium salt and alkyl group can be anything so it is generally c6h5 right now biomolecules it will be involving carbohydrates rna dna it is like that so now this is the syllabus that is left like but there is one more point that is added actually it is added in your syllabus so what is this it is practical chemistry and this practical chemistry is involving volumetric analysis that mean titration portion right and salt analysis salt analysis salt analysis that mean for cation for anion it is in your syllabus and volumetric analysis that mean titration came on the four right it's these like this so all these regarding practical chemistry it is added to your syllabus this is the new portion that you will be covering this time and these eight chapters that are has been that has been removed completely so these left chapters plus this practical chemistry portion is in your syllabus right now so you will have to cover all these topics and this practical chemistry and practical chemistry that mean volumetric analysis that mean titration portion and salt analysis that mean test of cation and anion you will have to see that so it is a new syllabus for chemistry so prepare according to the syllabus and please do not waste your time with these chapters these chapters okay so this was the reason this was the purpose of this video i hope you are getting this video as beneficial so you can take a screenshot of this this is the whole syllabus regarding chemistry so my dear students thank you thank you very much for this video Okay.